Well, somehow we got a nice December day. <laughs> so, I don't know if on the video you can see that big tree down there. I think there's a home site down by that tree. A little bit of a hike. Don't have a lot of daylight. Let's get at it. Well, there's the tree. I like what you got here. <laughs> I think we're in the right place. Let's dig. Okay, so I'm just kind of trying to dial in on the house side. Haven't dug anything good yet. But I got this. Oh, wow. Dude, that's a dandy button. <laughs> wow. That thing's beautiful. Let's see if there's anything on it. No, it looks like it's, uh, it's smooth, but man. You don't find these much in Montana. I'll tell you what. It's crazy. Clock piece? Yeah, we're definitely on a home site. We got a lantern piece. I don't know what I have here. Is that a projectile or just some sort of decoration? Okay, this turns out to be an antique soldering iron. Got some sort of a scutch in. Nice. I found the other one, but not even close to where the other one was, really. Probably 25 feet away. So that's an odd piece, and I think whatever that is on the end right there is actually sterling. I'll have to test it to be sure, but crazy. Well, I'm not going to lie. It's so junky here, it's hard to even lock in on anything. But... Let me clean that up. But look at that. It's a beautiful general service button. And look, I think somebody had it on a necklace because that's a weird thing to have on the back. Very cool. You know, I don't know what I have here. It's a safety first sign. There's a lot of writing on it. But my problem is, is my, my problem is, it's getting close to dark. I still have to hike up to the car, and I still want to detect. So, I'm going to clean this up at home and then give you guys a pick. All right, this sign says, Stop Accidents. Safety first. The best safety device known is a careful man. Fairmont Railway. Motors. Motors, Inc. This is such an interesting feature. This is on like a little rock cliff. And I think what they're doing is there's a little gap right here. And I think that's a sheep wall probably. Keep them from crossing over. Boy, it really stinks right here. There's some sort of critter living around here. Well, it's getting dark. Unless I just bumped something. I think this is it for the night. Uh, you know, short little after work hunt. Hopefully I can get back to this before uh, winter sets in and uh, next time bring my mini coil. Look at that face. So, I'm back, but I'm with Dinwiddie. And we're kind of walking the road in. See if we could bump a croto bell or something and he says he's got a charm. Oh, is this something, isn't it? Yeah, dude. <laughs> oh, you know what this is? What is it? It's a bull Durham. Yeah. Awesome, man. Bull Durham charm. You won't be able to see it, but there's a mark on the back that says 14K, which got me excited. I don't know why. It's obviously not gold. <laughs> but it says 14K gold plated. Bull Durham, baby. <laughs> Well, I'm not quite to the side. I'm still on the road. I think I got my first coin. Oh, that's a weedy. What are you doing here? Let me see what year it is so we can at least date this place a little better. 
All right, that's what I'm talking about, 1910. So we're right there, we're second year weedy. Perfect, it's on. So there's gotta be a spill. This came up at 20, so this is gonna be an Indian, I think. No, another weedy. Ah, I'm sure I'm pretty shave. Oh yeah, weedies don't usually ring that low. Let me see the year. You know, for a second there, I thought it was a 1922D. I can't tell. I think it's a 22, 23, or 24. I just can't tell. <laughs> uh, I got a third one. What the hell is going on around here? That one looks like 1919. Look at that, I got a pocket knife. Looks like it was dropped open. Well, when I was here the other day, I got a military button. <laughs> and remember, it had the little ring on the back. That's two. Huh, I wonder where they had that hanging on. Beautiful though, right? Dang. Some handmade little heart. Pretty crude, but good heart. Some lost love. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see that, but there's a looks like a wagon or part of a wagon buried in the ground right here, I think. So this is a little different hunt than I've ever done. I'm trying to find an old railroad camp. I'm in a ranch that's near the railroad. And I know that they had to camp in here, and there's just, I mean, it's crazy. There's just tin everywhere. And here's like a bowl. I actually haven't found anything good yet. And maybe that's to be expected because they're probably all pretty poor. But my gosh, I just want to find something cool down here. See what we can get. Yeah, unfortunately, there hasn't been a lot to show you. I got this thing. <laughs> There's a bunch of uh, bullets, and they're definitely older. You know, they look like they're eh, around 1900. So, man, we just need someone to have dropped something cool. Look at that, a clock part. <laughs> All right, a little bit of hope. A gear. <laughs> the funny thing is, I'm just in the middle of nowhere right here. In fact... I'm actually a little ways from the railroad, but you now when you bumped in, you just got to stop. I can't believe it. They did it. I think I got a coin right here. What's it going to be? Now, is that seriously going to be a weedy right now? Come on. Robbed. Well, I guess for a hunt like this, it's hard to complain about getting coins. Dang, there's another weedy. See what year this is. I'm not sure what year the railroad came through here, but might not have been till the 20s. That could be the problem we're having. Let me get a date. All right, so maybe I failed. Because <laughs> that says 1939D. And I'm pretty sure the railroad came through before that. So maybe this is not a railroad camp. But it's been fun so far. Uh, maybe just some ranchers down here at a campsite or a small cabin. Well, this isn't a bad way to fail. I got another coin. What the heck? Another weedy. Okay, well... I'm just gonna have to battle it here tonight because I only have like an hour of hunting left and I'm getting stuff. We got this time. That looks like 40 something. That's funny. Three Wheaties in the middle of nowhere. Well, I just pulled this spike and I don't know. Something, something. <laughs> this whole. I don't know what that is. 
interesting. Well, that was a fun little night. Unfortunately, didn't uh, exactly meet the goal, but hey, we got on some treasure. And this isn't over. <laughs> I'll be back. Hopefully this year, but it's getting late into December. And man, this is just crazy that I'm digging this late. Just had such good weather. So hopefully the weather, weather will hold out so I can do this. But otherwise, you'll see probably an episode like this next spring.